I'm Bud Anthony Diaz coming to you live from a stinky garage. I'm from Playa del Rey, California. I know there's a lot of craziness going on in the world right now. Anywho, what I'm trying to get at is there's something that is happening in this country that no one is talking about. Let me just go ahead and go to the trusty whiteboard here. What I want to talk about is um, LET, or as the common acronym, which is Laser Earth Theory. Oh, now, my God. Have you heard of Laser Earth Theory? Well, now I have. All the nations of the universe are at war with each other over the device. The device is kind of like a bunch of triangles attached to a square. Do you understand? No. The device has the ability to explode at any minute, and no one knows when it's going to go off. When it does happen, it's going to emit a laser. A laser that's going to go around the Earth. Boo! Kind of like Saturn. Exactly. Or a globe. Now, the thing is, all the countries in the universe, they want the device because they want to control what sea level that it it, it's at when it goes off. Do you understand? Well, yeah, I mean... Because that's important. The sea level is the crucial step to this device because if if you have it go off at 100 feet sea level, all the nations that are at 100 sea level will perish. Do you get it? I feel like this is a bit, but... It's not a bit, dude. I mean, it's pretty nuts. Because- Shut up! I mean, well, here's sh- the drill. Shouldn't we all be, like, running for cover? You have to think of more than just people because you have to think of infrastructure, okay? If you put it off at 2,000 above sea level, there could be precious infrastructure, water pipes, gas lines. It could all get chopped in half. When the laser goes off, it, it okay, imagine a tree. A laser cuts the tree in half. The tree doesn't fall over. There's no pressure from the laser it's just a clean cut you seem okay? very angry i'm not angry i'm passionate there's a difference i'm passionate i can't about tell the difference thi- what well i mean you, uh, angry passionate let's i'm say. sweating in a bed aren't i oh well uh, i mean wait a minute did you say my I name i am or a you... certified apple technician 2015 oh well i changed all let me take back what i said i'm now I believe you. I went to the Embassy Suites in Marina del Rey, which is different from Playa del Rey. Oh, I know And that. I sat through a six-hour seminar to get that damn piece of paper. If you go to a seminar, and you, know, you have to pay money, and then they give you the free coffee, it seems like a bit of a brainwashing situation. Ah, no, 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 no. You don't get it. Look, the laser's going to go off, and you need to be in the right place at the right time when it does, which means you have to connect through the Internet with the other nations. And you have to find out who has the device. Where will the device be? What sea level will it be at? Sea level is crucial. Do you understand now, Abed? I guess uh, passion does sell anything. People will ask me often, Bud, how do you know that the laser is going to go off? I just know. Wake up! You can't send it into space. Everyone keeps asking me. We tried that. You can't burn the books if they're cursed. They don't burn. Elon Musk, he sent it up in his Tesla, and it comes back down to Earth every time. It has to stay above the highest mountain peak to the lowest valley. That's the only place it can exist. People keep asking me, why don't you put the, the device underwater? And here's the one thing I always say to that, volcanoes. 